And thank you for watching Creative Loafing's annual food issue is actually hitting the stands today. And to celebrate, they're bringing back Tampa Bay's Restaurant Week, which also starts today. And joining us to talk about all things flavor and, of course, food, <laughs> we have Creative Loafing Marketing and Events Director Alexis Chamberlain and Chef James King. Welcome, guys. Hi, thank, thank you. you. Oh, we're excited to be here. Yes, Absolutely. we're getting cooking lessons. I love this. Yeah, but first, yeah. let's talk about Restaurant Week, Alexis, because yes. this is an awesome event every year. Yeah, and this is our 16th year so it's been happening for a while we're excited to bring it back we're partnering with more than 40 locations all throughout the Tampa Bay area on prefix menus so if you go to our website tampabayrestaurantweek.com you can check out all the menus see what looks appealing to you and when you go into the locations you just ask for the restaurant week menu that's very important people need to yeah. know that they have to purposely ask for it yeah for that menu mm -hmm. okay and I know that you've worked with feeding Tampa Bay yes. before but mm -hmm. this year you're teaming up with them as well so yeah. everything you spend on these dishes yeah so so we're Good giving a portion of the proceeds to them, so Creative Loafing's proceeds. Um, and yeah, we're just, we love supporting local. You get to go to a local restaurant, support a local nonprofit, and just eat some really amazing food. Okay. Like, <laughs> like James, Girl, yes. we're getting cooking lessons. I'm loving this. Yeah, James, yeah. tell us what you're making. All right, so today I'm showcasing the Delmonico steak. So this is one of the steaks that we're gonna be doing during uh, restaurant week, and it's gonna be at Taste, that's at the Embassy Suites. Um, that menu is like very uh, modern and progressive. The, the chef there, he's he's got fantastic shareable entrees, but this was one that we were battling back and forth about, and this is a classic dish. This comes from New York City, which is where I'm from, 1800s, but we're, we, you know, we're doing it right today. We're doing it skillet fried, with uh, with olive oil, butter, and garlic. Yum. Yeah. Okay. And yes. you marinated your peppers <laughs> yeah. over here in balsamic olive oil. That's right. And, and, no, olive oil, and then you're just grilling them here. That's basically. right. So I mean, the dish itself that's going to be served at uh, Taste is more of a steak frites. We have mm -hmm. fries, but I didn't have any way of making fries today. So I'm just showing okay. people at home how they can cook a steak at home, and, and it's still summer inspired, right? Grilled Very vegetables good. in the, the vegetables. summer makes sense, right? Absolutely. So I'm just going to grab a little bit of these herbs here, mm -hmm. throw them into the into the uh, butter here. Okay. And I'm just going to keep spooning over the butter onto the steak and you've wrapped this uh, steak in a string here that's right uh, a butcher's twine so mm -hmm. basically what that does is as you grill it it will maintain that shape so it's kind of cool because it makes this nice thick presentation for your guests you know it makes it look like you guys have like a 16 18 ounce steak it's not but it's still fantastic to show the guest yeah there and this you is go. what, how you trick. described it earlier before we started the show was what um, oh, make it, was, it look what make it sexy make it look sexy in the middle of the plate I'm like I'm stealing that. that is so cool. Yeah, 100%. Um, yeah. 100%. And you know what I love about um, Restaurant Week is you get to sample things on the menu that mm -hmm. you wouldn't regularly try because it's a less expensive menu because there's a little bit smaller portions of mm -hmm. everything, right? That's right. That's absolutely correct. I mean, what I've oh, done here is, is show, showcase what it would look like in an entree format. It'll be a little bit smaller than this, but uh, we definitely want diners to work their way through all the flavors of all the uh, things that we're inspiring people to eat. So, like, basically, we've got over here the New York uh, cheesecake. It's uh -huh. my version of it. It oh. is a trifle form. So basically I took, instead of having that, that graham cracker crust, mm -hmm. I yeah. used baklava on the outside with oh. uh, cookie crumb. And then that's ricotta and mascarpone and of course uh, fresh strawberry preserves that's all the way through. Uh, so that's Delicious. pretty cool. Interesting. And then the, another one of my favorite dishes right here, this is the, the pulpo. So this is your grilled mm -hmm. octopus dish. A little bit of uh, Greek flavors in that farro, which is like uh, cucumbers, lemon, mint, a lot going on there. Kalamata olives, capers, fantastic. That's what I'm talking I about. I love it. And yeah. Alexis, yeah. there's also going to be um, some d different uh, liquors and things like yeah, that. So Real some quick. of the locations will be mm -hmm. doing drink specials. Okay. So we have Prescription Vineyards Wine, Garrison Brothers Distillery, and Tito's Handmade Vodka. Oh, nice. So those are add-ons to the menu. So you'll see all that on the website. There's also a map so you can like plan your course of action, see what's close to you, what you want to travel Love. for. And, and visit them more than once. Yes. That's the whole thing because it's the entire week. June 16th through the 26th. Just ask for the menu at the restaurant that you select at TampaBayRestaurantWeek.com and thank you so much, Chef and Alexis, for coming here yeah, to our okay. kitchen. Okay.